I bet you've been dying to drive another 10-ton monster, right? Well... Good, because I got another guzzler on the list. Which army base do I go to this time? You know, the kind that's supposed to be able to drive over mountains. But nobody tries because they'd bust all the lights and grills? You got it. Now go get it. twice in one week. Seriously, you again? So For the greatest time. And I saw that boy hanging all around. No, not tomorrow. We do it now. By tomorrow you have the time to warn the cops or your gang or whoever. If we do it now, I know you won't fuck me. Alright then. But you're all sure it's a good idea. You can stay here if you want, but don't ask me to buy you model cars when I'm a drizillionaire and you're not. When you say it like that, it sure is hard to say no. So, just to go over the plan, I stay in the car while... Nope, this is a family package, big bro. Johnny will stay in the car. But he's better at shooting than I am. Sounds good. Let's get the move on. Everyone down on the ground, this is a holdup! Hey you, what the hell are you- One less to come back. said you'd get me enough cash to build the ultimate gas station. But now that you make good, I think I'll do fewer repairs and put more time into my racing techniques. So, it's the end of our little chop shop enterprise? No more robbing big mafia bosses? What will I do with all my spare time? I'm a big mafia boss now. No offense, but I was talking more about that Vega guy. Don't know, don't care. But you, on the other hand, if you have some time to kill, just stop by. I suppose you know where to find me. If it is not my bank robbing brother, I knew you couldn't resist. Er, uh, yeah, brother. You wanted something from me? Yes. Your driving skills, bro. Another racing fanatic. You should hang out with Albert. More racing this time. 
I want you to drive smooth. As smooth as the skin of the ladies you're gonna drive around. Why don't you get yourself a chauffeur? I want someone I can trust. And you know bro, I can trust you. Johnny, me Tracy, Tracy, Johnny, nice to meet you, enough chit chatting, we got a big client on your other side of town, he needs a like no, alright, what's the fastest way to get there, by hopping in one of these babies.
I just have to break away From this world of emptiness Don't you hear my distress? Now I'm alone in the rain And all this rage goes through my vein What am I waiting for? There you go girl, have fun and stay safe Why in the world would Uncle Sam be making a big deal out of a flamethrower? This is state of the art. Works on propane. Papa used one of these in Vietnam. He never told me that. Lots of you ain't never been told. But I tell you this. Vietnam will look like a picnic compared to the swamp once I get this baby down there. Okay, you old fat Judas, you better be wearing your asbestos underwear, cause we're gonna fry your ass like a pig on a spit. Come on! Nothing. Not a trace of Roscoe. We'll be back. Look, Johnny, I'm more than happy to help you fight your way to an Armageddon payback. But I'm not up for sitting around this creepy joint waiting around for the guy. Now go back to my apartment. Elsie and Joey, if you want some rest, you'll have to share the couch. Don't worry about your couch. I already got a hotel room with a nice view of the sea. I can even double it up for Joey. Just where do you think you're sneaking off to, Betty? This doesn't have to do with you, Johnny. Just go back to bed. Ain't gonna happen, honey. You saw Roscoe at the swamp. I didn't say anything then, but I gotta wonder why you lied. It wasn't to protect him, Johnny, if that's what you're worried about. Sure, I didn't want you guys to touch him, but only because I have a personal score to settle first. Alright, fair enough. But you'll need help. It's never good to fight angry. You make mistakes. Please, John, stay here. It's personal. I haven't known you long enough to tell you everything that went on up there. Well, I want you around long enough to be able to tell me. I'm going with you. 
Now you sound like Joey. I said no, Johnny. And I mean it. Okay. But leave a tooth or two for me to knock out. I'll see what I can do. Does this sound... Job, did you? What did I ever do to you to deserve this? Are you kidding me? You took advantage of me in every way you could think of. Come on now. When you came here, you had nothing in this world. I took you in, gave you protection, treated you like a wife. And then you sell me off to some big shot cartel boss when you don't need me anymore? You say you gave me protection. It's too bad there was no one to protect me from you. You know I wouldn't have let anything bad happen to you, Betty. You've put my life on the line a hundred times before just to protect your own wrinkly ass, Roscoe. If Johnny hadn't ever come here, I'm sure you would have found another way to get me killed. Betty, I can't take any more of this. Just kill me now and get it over with. <sighs> You'd love for it to be that easy, wouldn't you? God bless the Second Amendment. I got my pound of flesh, but I left half a pound for you. Why don't you guys just kill him and get over it? Like Betty said, it's too easy. He used me. Made me kill it's a waste people. of time playing payback with this fossil when we know some of the people we went to war with are going to be coming back at us. Maybe we can have our cake and eat it too. Betty, how long has Roscoe been up there hiding from cops and the FBI? So let's tell the cops exactly where he is. Won't be hard to find now that it's all burned up like the rainforest and shit. That's perfect, Joey. The perfect humiliation. That's what I want more than his death, Johnny. That old fuck to get cornhole to death in a slimy prison cell by some freak who likes old men. I'm sure we can attract the cops to the junkyard with a few rounds from this bad boy. You're listening to Rock Tour Nutty. have the right to die. You have the right to die.
Miami's about to have one. You do not want to do this! Ah! Ah, uh, not again! About to have one less scumbag. Respect and obey. You have the right to die. about to have one less scumbag. Easy, pal. You do not- You're out of line, civilian! You're gonna make an excellent wallet! See this uniform? Wrong move, buddy! Do you see this uniform? Wrong move, buddy! I don't want that to change, Clive. Ten years. No filthy cops. I don't want that to change. Don't want that to change. I couldn't have done this without you, LC. Thanks. I appreciate the sentiment, Johnny, but... I gotta get a little taste of the action. Thank you feels good, but you can't eat it. Roscoe had this and a mayonnaise jar under the front porch. That'll get you back to L.A. in style. And I know a nice villa for the taking. Herman K. was number two on my list, Betty. With Roscoe gone, he's now at the top. Roscoe ruled a junkyard. Herman K is the king of Miami. Going after him is suicide. Are you forgetting that he's the guy who led us into the trap? 
I don't forget anything, Johnny. Like I'll never be able to forget all of this slaughter. I'm done with blood. What do you say, Elsie? Let's kill him! Hey everyone, this is Dan- They say about real estate, boy. Location, location. Very nice. Location. Complete with armed guards at every door. Ready, Ranchero? Yes, sir. Not. Let's give him a shower. on I think I may be on the market again. Oh yeah? For the greatest guy and the coolest Machine. guy, let your best be a lot of work without getting a key to the front door. Let me do some shooting next time, Johnny. You're not getting anywhere near this place. As for the Villa LC, once King K is separated from his head, we'll be lighting cigars with hundred dollar bills in his living room. I thought of a new way to kill someone every day they had me locked up. You boys talking about? Joey had an idea. We can't get to Kay, but we can get to his car. Rig it up the way we took care of Crowbar Carosa back when I was learning the ropes. He goes to back out of that long and winding driveway. Boom! The Rocket's Red Player. It's a winner, Johnny. This isn't some kind of game, Joey. Leave Herman to me and LC. You stay here and think of plans to keep out of trouble instead. Aw, oh, man! Keep it rolling with another from the heavy, big, bad wolf. Well, 
Well, what's the big plan, Johnny? We're gonna do what Joey said. I just didn't want to encourage him. What do you say we sneak in and grab the car? Sure! And then get one of my boys who's good with a wrench to pack the trunk. Just make sure nobody sees you in there. Then we bring it back and park it right where it was before. Can't go wrong. you were hooked up with these guys, LC. You could have saved me a lot of trouble had I known Johnny was your friend. It's a small world, Albert. The more people you know, the smaller it gets. And I didn't plan on doing jobs in Miami this week. All right, you two. Bring her on home, but be very careful. Stay on the highway. You don't even want to risk running over a hamburger wrapper on the street. It's that sensitive. Like a newborn's ass sensitive. is Thunder Heist with Jerkin. What you know about a bang bang, don't you wanna know? But you can't take coat, we let you take off your coat. Show you something never seen before. Booty rockin' show, stopping every... Now, we wait. How long? It seemed like a good idea. I'm not waiting around anymore just hoping that something or other kills this guy. Lead the way then, Chief. But you better have something special up your sleeve because Kay has been bulletproof so far. He's a jolly good fellow, which nobody can deny. We're here! Oh, honey, I love camping. The sound of nature. Together as a family, you should be more careful, puts. Together, fam. Together as a sugar. Together as a together. Together as a family, away from everyday stress. Oh crap! Ah! Oh my God! What's your problem? <coughs> Hellish campgrounds. The adventure of a lifetime. <laughs> Make a fresh cut. The Cheap Cuts Barbershop will get you in and out with a brand new haircut at any cost. That's right. So if you have $5, we'll get you a $5 haircut. What the if you have hell? $1, we'll get you a $1 haircut. Maybe a curl or something. Oh. If you're satisfied, we'll shave your head for free. Cheap Cuts Barbershop. Cheapest cuts in town. Hell yeah. Now's your chance, Johnny. Here's a rifle. Time to go rat hunting. Wait here. Search his pockets, LC. I'm sure you'll find the key to the front door of the villa and Herman K's liquor cabinet. Like I said, Johnny, it's good to be king. Let's go check out the castle. What's 
wrong, Johnny. We didn't just get revenge, we did the world a favor. We just got rid of one of the world's biggest assholes and we get to put our feet up on his furniture at the same time. Something's missing. Something or someone. Bet he was right, LC. Man, an eye for an eye just makes everybody blind. I'm no better than the goons who wanted didn't to start string us up. Johnny. Those guys started it by snatching me. You'd be an awful brother not to come chasing after me. And I'm glad to have you back, boy. More than you know. I wish I hadn't lost my girl along the way.